Welcome to Briggs and Moore. My name is George O'Dolling. I'm the construction skills tutor here. We've got a good crowd of lads here. Uh, some of them have construction uh, knowledge and skills. They've worked on site as labourers, but now they want to they realise they want to upskill themselves and they want to learn a profession. And that's what we're here to facilitate uh, and hopefully get them through the training and get them into apprenticeships and into employment. It's really a wellbeing program to gain skills and hopefully help them progress um, in their recovery as well. My job is to try to turn that initial momentum into action that leads towards um, successful, sustainable employment. I've done some plastering and I'm brick that now. Since my has been very helpful. So brilliant to work with him here. I'm, I'm hoping to get an apprenticeship. We're quite unique because we are St Mungo's and the client group we work with come from quite severe traumatised backgrounds. Self-esteem is very low. Self-worth is very, very low. Uh, when they start the courses, it can be a bit overwhelming. So it takes a couple of weeks to kind of build, start building that confidence. I, I had a back injury. I didn't walk for 14 months. I've become homeless. And then um, that's how I got in with St Mungo's and uh, started walking about seven months ago again. I'm a qualified plasterer. So I'm obviously going to try and do as much as I can with which St Mungo's offer you to uh, get myself back into work. The Construction Skills Programme is a safe space. It's totally inclusive. You'll be so surprised from week one to week three on how that group becomes a family. I've come from a bad kind of background. What it is, is um, yeah, when you're on the streets and all that, you do kind of feel like you're on your own. Parents have passed away years ago, so basically I've been like kind of on my own and had no support. You know what, if it weren't for St Mungo's, and especially my worker that works for St Mungo's, if it weren't for him being there to support me, still be out there.